<laughs> Show me. Hi, I'm David Anderson Official, but my Instagram doesn't work right now. <laughs> Well, this is the bike I rode for all of 2019. I even painted it, but the paint's coming off now. So I think it's time to freshen it up. So I got a new frame and I'm gonna do a new 2020 bike build. And that's that's the first clip. <laughs> Hold on. I don't know, See, I thought they it was opened good. it at the bike shop and I wanted the sound of the staples opening, but it's already been open, so I'm not I'm not gonna pretend or anything. I don't don't want you guys to think I'm like a fraud. Anyways, so I got a new frame, and it's the new colorway for 2020 of the same exact frame. I'll cut that out. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, black. It's black. <laughs> you can see. <laughs> So the first update I'm doing to my new bike, besides the frame, is these darn doodly floors. Uh, so I have the R25s on right now. And with this new bike build, I'm going to do the R15 forks. So it's going to be the same dimension frames, but I'm going to have a way steeper offset for my forks. So see this part? I'll cut out from the middle, right? But then when I finally find all these pieces that I'm trying to find, then I'll, I'll put it back on, you know what I mean? That's my favorite song. I told, I told you I could do it. spin <laughs> all right that's good for now thanks 2020 <laughs> no i'm just kidding <laughs> uh, i'm gonna be running the same seat in post it's a bsd on a bsd on a bsd that's actually the height i prefer i'm a pretty lengthy guy so now, a little tip for you at home viewers. If you're ever putting a bike together and you like putting the seat on first like me, don't tighten it all the way. Uh, okay, so I got brand new forks on a brand new frame, brand new headset bearings. Same headset cap, I'm not that fancy. But uh, I'm gonna put the same bars and stem combo on. It doesn't say the name, but it's some type of a clat stem top load on BSD Safari bars, and I think the Safari bars are like 9.6. Do you want me to scoot back? I know I'm really tall, sorry. Is You're it, so long. Is this okay? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason I like putting the seat on is, like, as the first part of the build is because it's just a lot easier to sit on the bike and build it when you have a bad back. <laughs> I keep my neighbors up all night. For different reasons this time, baby. Hmm? When? I was totally kidding. Do you think I'm really gonna do another bike check and have you guys roast me in the comment section for not greasing my bearings? I got brand new bearings, brand new frame, and I'm gonna grease it. So you guys better subscribe. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't do that one. <laughs> it's so funny. No, but really, I put the wrong spacer on and I had to take the stem back off and then it was really hard to get out, so I was like, I should probably grease it in case I ever have to take it off again. So, I'm gonna do that. Okay. 
But look at me, I'm greasing my bike. You guys are, you guys are gonna be so proud of me. Remember when I was just at measly 2,000 subscribers, no grease in sight. Now here I am, a thousand subscribers later, grease and everything. <sighs> okay, you can turn it off now. All greased up, even my stem. So I wanna freaking hear it. I'm really excited to try the R15s on my bike because I've rode them on a few different people's bikes. And I really like being able to cap nose three like every try. I'm Jen. What is your app, Jen? I'm Emmanuel. So I'm going with the same exact grips as last time and getting uh, the Odyssey Rainford grips. But in black this time since, you know. <sighs> I'm so stressed out. Meanwhile, I'm over here building a fucking mansion. That's going in. No. You know, actually, I haven't had any experiences with um, videos being demonetized because of cursing because a lot of the times, would you look at me when I'm talking to you? Like. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you can scratch this, and I won't yell at you. You can walk up that, there's stairs. He's not looking at me like that. <laughs> <laughs> Just playing in your new house I bought you. He doesn't understand. Toby, you don't like it? I'm going to the zone right now. I'm hitting the barrier. I found a bunch of arrows on the ground. Someone's inventory was full, so they couldn't take them. Nice. I'm going to you, Dylan. Oh, I see pink team. That's pink team. I'm just hiding behind them. Where's your pink team? This would be a great scenario to have. I had to factory reset my phone oh, before shit. I could finish building the bike, so I built a lot of it off camera. Thank God. So I'll just go ahead and do the bike check part of it and then ride it. I'm using it. Alright guys, so I built the bike mostly on camera, but uh, then I had to factory reset my phone to get Instagram back, so I just kind of built it off camera, and then I got sick, so then I couldn't ride it for a week, but here's my new bike. So this is my first day riding it. It's the same ALVX frame, the 20.6 top two, just in the black 2020 colorway, and then I got these R15 Odyssey forks, way steeper offset, thanks to my filmer guy, Kyle, that's filming this right now. Um, I had to mess around with the headset for a while because it wasn't working, but I just got a fiend cap on there. It's kind of weird. Uh, a clat top load, I have no idea what the stem's called. And then the BSD Reed Stark Safari bars in 9.6 with Brock Radford grips. This is the same wheel set I was riding on my other bike. They're just uh, G-Sport roll cage rims in the toothpaste colorway with a, a G-Sport whatever front hub, roll away front hub, and then an Odyssey clutch V2 in the back. 28.9 for a while, and I switched it up, so I'm back to 25.9, and I got the a clat uh, with the removable guard. Uh, the AK sprocket, and then these are just demolition rig cranks, and I got Odyssey JCPCs. Um, I got a new Shadow Supreme chain. I got it in black this time, match the new colorway. And then I got the all four Eclat Venom pegs in 4.8. I like the little bit longer pegs. Um, it's just the same BSD bottom bracket, just greased up nice. And then uh, for the hub guards, I just have the G Sport. Um, Uniguard on both sides now. I just had one before with the clutch plastic guard, but that really doesn't hold up very long So I got both metal 
and then the front I just have the G Sport hub guards that come with the roll away hub. Uh, other than that, I just got a BSD seat post with the BSD fat seat on there. But uh, I really like having a black frame again. So now get some clips on the bike. I'm excited to show you guys all the edit clips that I've been getting this year and last year. I think that's it. I feel like I could edit all that and make it work. Did I forget any parts? Oh, these are Alex Donachi Donna Squeak tires in 2.4. Uh, just your average tube, and you can't forget about the dice valve caps. They're very important. I've said that in every single bike check I've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> the dice spike check, or yeah. the dice valve caps? Yeah, they're my lucky dice, bro. Alright, I'm good with that. I'll edit all that. Yo. I think you guys should let me